Welcome to Resistance Jolt. Grab your kettlebells, get on your mat, and let's go. You guys ready to do this? All right, let's go ahead and warm up the body. Just little arm circles right here. Good. Now let's open it up a little bit more. Good job. Now we're just getting the body ready for the rest of the workout, okay? So let's reverse it. So this is all resistance training here. Now, you wanna make sure that you have the right weighted kettlebell. I'll go ahead and coach you through that. If you need to drop down in weight, that's okay. It's more important that you go ahead and you stay with the proper form and technique. Good. Now, let's go ahead and do some twists here. Just march it out. You want your knees to point to 10 and two. Rotate that torso. We're just slowly warming up the body here. And raise your knees just a little higher, maybe about waist height. Good. Some deep breaths, get some air in those lungs. Just a couple more. All right, now let's warm up those legs. Some sumo squats. Let's go right into it. Good. Now your toes are gonna be pointed towards the corner of the room. You wanna keep the weight in your heels. Just squeeze when you get to the top. You're gonna feel this in your glutes in your quads. Good job, 15 more seconds. That chest up, shoulders back. Keep going. You good? All right. All right, the last exercise here, these are gonna be called fly jacks. Now we're coming to the end of the warm up. We're gonna go right into a squat with an overhead press. You should be breathing a little bit heavier now. Body temp's coming up. Nice. 10 more seconds. Are you guys ready to do this? Yeah. All right. Good, a couple more. All right, let's go. Go ahead and grab your kettlebell. We're gonna step to the right with an overhead press. Let's take it out. Up, good. Straight up. Just a side step, and push the kettlebell straight up to the ceiling. Now you're gonna feel this in your legs and your shoulders. Make sure you're keeping that chest up. Whew. Nice, keeping your knee right over top of your toe. Whew. All the way up, breathe through the exercise. Whew. Nice. Now if you can go a little deeper, I challenge you, your body's ready for it. Good. Find a nice little tempo. Good. You wanna pace yourself through the workout. These are two minute intervals. Good job. You guys good? All right, now we're halfway through. All right, so now your heart rate's up. You have Laura here. You can see how she's just stepping. It's not a wide step. It's basically a step to a squat. She's working her legs here, toning the legs, shoulders too. She's got her great form. That knee is right over top of the toe. How you doing? Good? Yeah, all right. Good job, Deb. You're looking great. Where are you feeling this? On your butt? Good. All right, give me another 30 seconds here, guys. Ready? Let's do this together. Remember, just find a nice tempo. Check in with yourself. Make sure you keep the right form. Good. A couple more. Last 10 seconds. Ooh, almost there, you got a feel of burn in those legs. Good. All right, nice job, guys. Congratulations. Now we're gonna go on to the next exercise. It's gonna be a reverse lunge and you're gonna hold that kettlebell over top of your head. So take that right leg back, right arm straight up, okay? And now let's go up into it, good. Reverse and press. Now the key here is you wanna take that right leg, imagine as though you're standing on railroad tracks. Going straight back and pressing up. You're gonna feel this in your legs. You wanna make sure that that kettlebell is stacked directly over top of your shoulders. Good. Now that front knee should be behind that front toe and the back knee is going straight down to the ground. Good job, how you guys doing? Awesome, all right, so we have Deb over here. She's doing a great job. 
You can see, like I said, that kettlebell stacked directly over top of her shoulder. She's stepping straight back. Front knee is behind that front toe. Great job. Where are you feeling this one? In the legs? Great. That's where you should be. How about you, Laura? Feeling it up there? Again, notice how Laura's core is stable. She's keeping her hips pointed towards the front. Shoulders also squared up towards the front. Now let's go ahead and switch to the other side. Again, we're just gonna do what we did on the right. Good. And mirror it on the left side. Straight up. And press. Now again, some of the benefits of this is you're gonna be working those legs, your core, and your shoulders. This is a full body workout here. Yes, it is. 30 more seconds. Good. Now, if it gets a little challenging for you, don't be afraid to pause. It's okay. I just want you to jump back in whenever you're ready. And press. Good job. Keep it going. Breathe. Stay here, guys. Stay here with me. Good. 15 more seconds. Press. Straight up. Good. How you doing back there, Jason? Good. Back. Last five seconds here. Good. All right, good job, guys. Now, the next exercise we're gonna go into, it's a ballistic row, okay? Feet are about shoulder width apart. I want you to keep the tempo with us. Hinge at the hips, and let's do it. Pull it up, good. Now, this is more of a little bit higher intensity. We're working that upper back. So imagine taking that shoulder blade and pulling it towards the spine. You wanna be soft in the knees, a little bit of a hinge at the hips. So it's almost like a 45 degree angle. So you're gonna be right here. Good. Nice job. All upper back. Upper back, a little bit of lower back stability. You can see here with Laura, she's just got a nice little tempo. Kettlebell is coming down to the front of her and she's grabbing it and pulling. Imagine your spine and that shoulder blade is just giving it a nice little hug, all right? How are we doing, Jason? Doing good? Heart rate's up? Burning some calories? Having fun? Awesome job. Keep it up, guys. Halfway through, all right? Let's go. Let's keep going. One minute to go. Yeah. Deb, you good? All right. This is resistance work, guys. You're gonna get strong, all right? Just think strong, power. Nice. All right, we're getting there. Keep your tempo up. All right, yeah? Getting warm, that's good, I want you to. 30 more seconds to go, you gotta stay with me. Don't quit on me now. I hope you're sweating just as much as we are. <laughs> if you're not, I don't think you're working hard enough. Good. Nice. Keep it going. Last 15 seconds now, last 15. Come on, keep your tempo. Upper back burn. Yes. All right, last five guys, last five seconds. Come on. All right, good job. Congratulations, way to go, Deb. All right, now I'm gonna recommend you to go a little bit lighter on this next one. It's gonna be a tricep, single arm press. So take that kettlebell, palm of your hand, and let's just start pressing towards the ceiling. Good. Really stretch out that tricep. Now again, your feet are about shoulder width apart. Little hinge in the knees here. Chest up. And just control it on the way down. Now make sure you pull that elbow in. You'll really engage that tricep. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. All right. So. Laura, great job. Again, always working your way up your body. Just check in with yourself. There's several checkpoints. Your feet, knees, hips, and shoulders on this one. Again, she's taking it right behind her head, getting a full extension here on the tricep. You guys all right? Awesome, okay. Now, that was your right arm. Let's go ahead and switch it over, over to the left side. Ready, here we go. Press up. Again, I want you to make sure that these moves are safe and effective. 
If you find yourself really challenging doing the right form, I want you to go ahead and go a little bit lighter. Okay, maybe if it's too light for you, then go heavier. This is about you. The more you do these workouts, the stronger you're gonna get, right? We all started the same place you did. 30 seconds, come on. Keep it up. Remember, you wanna stay straight up here. Keep that chest up and take that kettlebell right behind your head, really extending that try. Last 15 seconds. Come on. It's burning, but it's a good burn. Oh yeah, it means it's working. Five seconds to go, last five. All right, good job guys. Now, we're gonna move on to the last exercise. It's actually one of my favorites. We do it in almost all of the Kettleworks workouts. It's the swing. So I want you to go ahead and grab a little heavier kettlebell here, and let's go right into it. Good. Make sure you get that proper form, proper stance. Nice. You're hinging at the hips. Straight up. All right. Again, knees are slightly bent, hinging at the hips. And when you're coming straight out in front, right about the top, it's almost like zero gravity. And then you're gonna use those legs to pull it back up along with your hips. Laura's doing a great job. You notice how she's hinging here at her hips? She's getting that kettlebell. It's right about shoulder height. She's letting it come back down. Again, full body exercise right here. Yeah? Heart rate's getting up? Yes. All right, good. You feel like you're burning some calories? Oh, yeah. Awesome, good job. Nice job, Deb. Way to go, Jason. Jason, now he's going with a little bit heavier weight, okay? You're halfway through this, keep it up. Keep going. Make sure you breathe. Good. How you doing, Dad? Yeah? Good. Heart rate's up. Coming up on the halfway of this exercise, guys. Yeah? Huh. We're jolting that body, resistance jolt. Yes, 30 seconds. Good. Nice. Again, you're working your lower back on this one. Should be feeling it all over that body. All right, 15 seconds, stay with me. Keep it going. Good job, guys. Last five, last five seconds. All right, nice job, guys. Congratulations. We're halfway through the workout. Just give me another 10 minutes, all right? We're gonna go back up to the top again. Go ahead and grab that kettlebell. We're gonna do a side step to an overhead press. We're gonna lead with the right. You guys ready to go? All right, let's take it out. Out and press. Straight up. Now remember, just find your tempo. It's a two minute interval here. Whew. Try to stay with us. Again, if you have to pause, it's okay. Nice job. Press, remember to push those hips back. Keep those knees over the toes. Good. Straight up. Legs and shoulders here. Keep breathing. Yeah. <laughs> you guys good? Yeah? All right. <laughs> Keep breathing, guys. Stay with us, okay? You're gonna feel the second time through. Good. All right. Now you're halfway through. Now, if you find it a little bit more challenging, it's okay again to drop your weight. We want you to stay with us. Keep that form, okay? Try not to go to failure, but fatigue. We really want to fatigue those muscles. Good. Straight up. That's feeling burn? Yeah, good. Press, guys. Press. Good. Last 30 seconds. Come on, you can do it. Don't quit on us. Stay with us. Straight up. Make sure you're pushing those hips toward the back of the room. Keep your chest up. Breathe. 15 seconds. Yep. 
Just think all those calories you're burning right now. You're gonna transform that body. <sighs> yeah, five seconds, come on. One more set here, press. All right, nice job, congratulations. All right, now we're gonna go into the next exercise. It's gonna be a reverse lunge, keeping that kettlebell above your head. All right, so it's the second time through. Here we go, ready? Let's take it back and press straight to the ceiling. Good job. Now again, this may be the second time through and you're feeling a little bit more challenged. It's okay to go ahead and drop the kettlebell off to your side, just like Jason. Good, and press up through. Good, all the way to the top. You're gonna feel it in your legs. Make sure you keep that core nice and stabilized and your shoulders and hips squared up. Good, yeah? Yeah. All right. Just find your tempo here, guys. Find your nice little rhythm. Legs and shoulders. Keep breathing. Keep that front knee behind the toe. Good. Straight back. Remember, it's okay to go ahead and pause, but just jump in whenever you're ready. It's an advanced workout, so I know your body's ready for this. Good. You guys good? All right, let's switch over to the other side. Ready? Let's take it back and straight up. Now we're just gonna mirror what we did on the right. Working the other side again. Knees behind the toe, back knee to the floor. Hips and shoulders are squared up and press. Good. Exhale on the way up. All right, you guys having fun? Yeah. <laughs> Good. 30 seconds to go. Press. <sighs> nice. <sighs> Good. Come on. Stay with me, guys. Don't quit me. Don't quit. <sighs> 15 seconds. If you lose your balance, it's okay. <sighs> Muscles are fatigued. You're fighting for it. Last 10. Come on. Five seconds to go. I'll give you a recovery. And awesome job. All right, ballistic row. If you have to go to a lighter weight, that's okay. Ready? Sports stance, right side. Let's pull it up. Good. Now you're working your upper back here. Make sure your feet are about shoulder width apart or a little further. Soften the knees and you're at about a 45 degree angle at your hips. That shoulder blade is squeezing and hugging that spine. Whew. Nice. 30 seconds into it. All right, how we doing? Good. We're good? She's doing awesome. She's doing great. What are you thinking about? Tank tops. Tank tops? All right. Here, let's do it together. Whew. All right. We're your training partner, all right? We're gonna get you through this. Just stay with us. Nice. We're good. How are we doing, Jason? All right. Halfway through this exercise, all right? You gotta stay with us. I don't want you to quit, all right? I don't want you to quit. You gotta stay. It's all about you. Ready? Keep it going. Yes. This stuff really works, guys. That's why we call it kettle works. <laughs> yeah. Good. Full extensions here. 30 seconds, all right, stay with us. For the last 30. How we doing, Doug? Good. Now you're also gonna feel this in the legs. All right. Come on, keep going. Come on. Yeah. You're actually working your whole body here. 15 seconds, come on. Come on. Come on, let's go, Deb. Come on, bust it out. Five seconds to go. Yeah, nice job. All right, guys, way to go. Now, we're gonna work the triceps. Go ahead, put the kettlebell in the palm of your hand. Right hand up, and let's take it down. Press straight up. Okay. Now the heart rate's gonna slow down a little bit. We're gonna isolate that try. Good. Keep that core nice and tight. 
Shoulders squared up. And press. Now the tank toss. Good job. Keep going, guys. 30 seconds into it. Give me another 30 on the right. Good. How's it going? You doing good? Yeah. All right, make sure you bend at the elbow. Make sure you bend at the elbow. Good job. How are we doing, Laura? Good. All right. You do? Look at this full extension she's getting here. Triceps, strong muscle. Let's go. Let's finish it off here. Come on, press it up. Press. All right, now let's go to the left side. Switch over, same thing. Let's go guys, up, press to the ceiling. Now remember, keep that elbow in. Lock it in straight towards us. And just let the kettlebell drop down behind your head now and press. All right. It's okay to be really heavy. If you're breathing heavy, that means you're working. We all are and we're sweating, all right? <laughs> 30 more seconds here, guys, 30 more seconds. Good, stay with us. Come on, don't quit, don't quit. Press, press, squeeze at the top. You good? Feel the burn? All right, 10 seconds to go, 10 seconds. Press, come on, come on. All the way, all the way, all the way. Go through the burn and you're done, all right. Now guys, we're going on to that last exercise. Kettlebell swing, again, you can go with a little bit heavier kettlebell on this one. We're going for two minutes. You guys ready to go? All right, let's take it home, here we go. Good. Remember, you're hinging at the hips here, right? Getting that kettlebell straight out in front of you. Good. I hope you're having fun, because we are. <laughs> it may not look like it, but we are. <laughs> All right, we're 30 seconds into it. Again, if you have to drop weight, it's okay to do. Keep that form. We're in the last two minutes here of the workout. This is where you gotta dig deep, all right? You gotta dig deep on this one. <sighs> That's right. Come on. You're transforming that body. Stay here. Keep breathing. Breathe, get some air in those lungs. All right, we're on our last minute. Last minute, stay with us, all right? And then we're gonna cool you down. All right. You ready to do this, Jason? All right, come on, let's go. Come on. Make sure you're hinging at the hips. Straight up. Come on. You're gonna feel it in your glutes, your lower back. Good, good, come on. All right, ready down? Last 30 seconds, let's take them home. Come on. Yep. We're almost there. Almost there. Come on. Come on. 15 seconds. 15, Laura. Last 10. 10 seconds. Come on. Come on. Work for it. Last one. All right. Awesome job. Congratulations. Resistance jolt. Let's go ahead and cool you down. Stretch out that quad, grab that right ankle, keep your knees nice and tight, close together, and tuck that pelvis. Breathe, stretch, congratulations. We're so proud and happy for you. Go ahead, and switch, other side. Just ease into it. If you lose your balance like that, jump back in. Good. Woo. Nice. Okay, hamstrings. There we go. Oh, and just ease back into it. Yeah, you're gonna feel all in the back of your leg here. Hands go over top of that bent leg. Good job, switch. Now I guarantee you're gonna feel a little sore after this one. Recovery is so important. Make sure you get one of our rejuvenation rollers. Roll out that tissue, but prepare you for the next work. 
All right, calves and triceps. Good job. Stretch out that calf. Feeling that? Good job, guys. Heart rate's coming down. Now let's switch. Other side. Pull it back. Oh. Oh, nice job. You guys think you burned some calories? You did? All right. All right, last one, shoulders. Bring that right arm across the body. Hold it there. Nice. Now, during this whole exercise and workout, you can tell we sweat. You should be too. Make sure you stay hydrated. It's really important to keep that body hydrated. It's gonna help you perform and recover. Let's just go to the other side. Hold it here. A little bit longer, give me about another five seconds. And congratulations, awesome job. You just made it through resistance jolt. We're excited to do the next workout with you. Good job, guys.